And now with the confidence of the children of God, let us lift up our voices to pray the Lord's Prayer in whatever translation or language that you address God most faithfully. Our Creator, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Thank you for joining us for this time of worship. There are a couple of announcements that I want to offer to you. Uh, most of you received an email uh, yesterday uh, about some of our ministry partners and one is Family Housing Network. Um, we often um, have tags for gifts for, for families and children um, with Family Housing Network. This year, if you want to support uh, this ministry, um, you're invited to send a check to the church and to write FHN Xmas in the memo. And for planning sake, if you would private chat, if you are able to do so with, with Judy to um, let her know if you intend to um, send an offering um, for Family Housing Network, that would be helpful. Uh, the other um, ministry partner um, that we support is Faith Action Network. And there's always a dinner right before Thanksgiving that um, about eight to 10 of us attend. This year it's a virtual dinner and that's going to be on November 15th. Um, and you need to register soon so that your names can be linked up with Robert's table. And so you can chat with Robert um, if you are interested or um, read the email again, refer back to that. Um, and um, it's always, um, so uplifting to go to these these um, dinners that Faith Action Network um, puts on and the speakers are always excellent. Thank you for those who continue to support United Church with your gifts and offerings, your talents. Many of you received your stewardship packet via email or by snail mail. And so please read over how you might covenant and partner with UCOP in the coming year. And I now invite Marilyn to lead us in the prayer of dedication. God who guides us on the journey, we offer our tithes and offerings to you and pray that the gifts we give might be used to bring your kingdom here on earth. Use not only these resources we offer, but use us. Use our hands, use our feet, use our voices, and use our hearts to shape the world for which you long. Strengthen us by your spirit to stay true to the journey. Amen. <laughs> 